Okay, before I start today's Launchbox video, if you like what you see today, hit notifications, subscribe and like so you don't miss upcoming retro emulation content here on my channel, just Jamie. That means you'll get notified every time I release a new video, plus it helps out my channel too. So we're looking at the latest release of Launchbox and for my regular followers here on my channel, you'll know that I really praise Launchbox. I'm a Launchbox Premium Big Box user. And it's just come to my attention today that we have now got version 13.14. Now, of course, this one's released a few days back, but I thought I'd give people a heads up out there just so you know it is. So if you've got Launchbox, you haven't fired up for a little while. Here we go, version 13.14. So we got several improvements here. Uh, added a final file matching step for loose media files. Uh, we also got resolved an issue where the last page of the ROM import wizard would be skipped in certain scenarios. And we also got resolved an issue with an emulator's configuration information under certain conditions when the emulator is first downloaded. And for PlayStation 2 fans, you'll be happy to know that PCSX2 ability to identify the BIOS order location in all scenarios has now been fixed. So from 13.13 launch box, implemented an ability to have emulators downloading such as the Dolphin emulator as well as PCSX2. Now if you're not sure what Launchbox is, you're not sure what it looks like, this is Launchbox. It's a very nice system and this is also free. Now in order to actually get the Big Box Premium Edition, it's around $30 to $40 I believe. Anyway, that's it for the brief Launchbox update video. Like I say, just to make Launchbox users aware that 13.14 is now available. So if you open up Launchbox, you're likely going to see an update unless you've done it already. If you're interested in setting up Launchbox for the first time, check out my fully comprehensive Launchbox setup guide. Now, I'm going to leave that in my description and that will get you to grips of how it works. Anyways, if you liked today's video, hit notification, subscribe and like so you don't miss upcoming retro emulation content. Also, join me on social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and TikTok. But until next time, stay retro.